Hey, in case you want to do some trailer pads or uh, shock tubes or boom pads, uh, boom cable pads, um, I'll show you what we did. We just did this recently. Um, we think it'll hold up pretty well. This is Sunbrella fabric. Um, got it from Amazon. You get it by the yard. Um, and they have all sorts of colors. Sunbrella is, you know, made for the sun and the rain, right? Or sun and the, yeah, sun and rain. So water and sun are two things boats get. Um, so they're pretty easy to do. Uh, the, the, the foam inside, um, this is actually a soft foam I got, but, um, the, this is a two inch PV or uh, ABS plastic pipe that's on here. So get insulation foam for that, uh, measure the circumference of it, and then add an inch. Because when you do this seam here, um, typically when you sew stuff, you'll have, uh, it's hard to see it in here, you're going to have uh, a half inch on either one that you're going to leave tailed off there. Um, so you're going to have this inside out, you're going to you'll pin it and, and sew a half inch in from the end. So half inch on each piece, that's your inch extra that you're going to have around here. Um, and then we have a half inch pocket we put on the end here um for our uh, elastic it's a eighth i just use an eighth inch elastic cord uh you can use whatever you want um so what we did on this one to keep the fabric from unraveling um we did a, a zigzag stitch to keep from unraveling we fold it over to make the half inch pocket and then you'll see the normal stitch holding that pocket closed um, and then we just put a paper clip or a um, safety pin on the end of the elastic and just cut it through like you would on a swimsuit or something like that um so that's how we did those um oh and then we so this we printed this malibu on here before we put the put it on the foam um we we put this on so my wife has a silhouette um uh, so we use um the heat transfer vinyl which you have to do it uh mirror image when you cut it out because it flips when you put it on um and what we did is we got this logo just off the web, the Malibu logo. The Silhouette software has a little feature. You hit trace and it just goes poof and it's traced. Um, and then we size it to how big we want it and cut it out. Um, the funny thing that happened about this, we, we picked what, my wife has tons of stuff. We picked the only white she had. We used it and later we got it in the dark and realized it's her glow in the dark, um, glow in the dark heat transfer. So um, it glows in the dark, which is not planned, but kind of unique. Um, so we, we printed that on one side, we printed our Samson's Water City School on the other side. Um, if you haven't heard of us, it's probably because we don't make any money off it. We are just, um, sharing our, our passion of the sport with other people, uh, people who don't usually get to get out on the water, whether it be friends, church groups. Um, we work a lot with, um, in his wakes ministries. We, we like helping them out. Um, they get, uh, underprivileged kids and, and people that from addictions and stuff out on the water. Uh, really challenges them life-changing honestly for for some of them we have a lot of kids that have said this is a better high than any drug i've ever had um it's a sad thing but it's a great thing at the same time um and we've had it's been some great great experiences every time we're with them there's there's unique stories are just you know heartwarming um so the only difference with the two differences with either a boom pad or a shock tube i don't have the shock tube with me is this strap on the end um, this one, I believe was about four, maybe five inches long, uh, cause there's some extra inside, um, just so it can hook onto the carabiner and stay up, um, and cover it up the, the clamps, right? Cause you don't want those to hit the boat. Um, so you have that. Um, and then on the shock tube, it's longer. Um, it was 16 inches total and we see, we put a stitch in it in the middle, about four inches that makes it. A little tighter loop to go onto the boom or onto the pylon um, but then you have some extra to still get the rope through as well um, so that's pretty typical we copied it from other ones um, the only other difference uh, is on the boom one itself is we instead of elastic we use a zip tie here um, that's copied from the original uh, boom pad which actually our boat is 22 years old right now and it just turned 22 about a week ago um, and we got the boom when we got it new and that pad lasted those 22 years. Um, I'll be happy if, if my custom pad lasts 10. Um, but, but anyway, um, that, that boom had zip ties on both ends. So we put zip ties there. Um, so that's really the only difference. We put our ski school logo on both sides of this one, but the trailer obviously had to have the Malibu on the side as well. So, um, there you go. There's boom pads 
uh, shock tubes and trailer, trailer guide pads.